everyone, thank you for tuning in to A Graders. Here's what to expect. Today we have with us an experienced science curriculum writer, Ms. Jodie, who will share with us what the Primary 5 students will be learning for science in September. So Jody, what are they learning this month? For P5, the school will be heading on to a topic on air and the respiratory system. So in this topic, it's actually related to the topic on body systems which the students have learned in P4. So this topic is concept heavy, thus students are actually required to remember multiple concepts. So for this topic, students must firstly recognize that air is a mixture of gases such as nitrogen, carbon dioxide, oxygen and water vapor. Not only that, students also have to know the proportion of different gases in our atmosphere shown in the table here. Okay, other than knowing about the proportion, students also have to know some of the basic usage of gases as shown in this table here as well. So, as there will be experimental questions relating to this topic, students are also required to know how to identify different types of gases present in the experiment. Okay, for example, presence of oxygen can be identified by burning a substance. When oxygen is present, uh, the glowing spin will actually rekindle. And while the test for carbon dioxide, it can be identified through bubbling it in lime water. So when there's carbon dioxide present, lime water will either turn more, uh, milky or chalky. So students not only have to know about the gases, right, they also have to know about the important process called respiration. And the definition as well, whereby respiration is a process where living things take in oxygen to break down digestive food and produce energy. So during respiration, carbon dioxide is given out as well. Another concept they have to be sure of is the different breathing methods of different organisms which were mentioned in their lower block and is shown in this table here. And next, students also have to know organs and functions of the human respiratory system shown in this table here as well. Okay, it is also crucial that students know how the human respiratory system works during inhaling and exhaling as shown here. Okay, so students actually have to remember all the concepts mentioned earlier to score well for this topic. Okay, so do you have any commonly tested questions to share with us? Okay, most questions on air and respiratory system requires knowledge recall and applying concepts to explanation questions. So let's look at an example shown here. So for part A, right, students have to use their science concept that during exercising, more energy will be required, thus we will respire faster. So since graph A shows a higher volume of air in, and it actually took a shorter time for one breath comparing to graph B, it indicated that the breathing rate is faster, resulting in faster respiration. So graph A will be the correct answer for the person that's exercising. Now for part B, students are supposed to answer based on explanation answering technique. Since there are no results provided in the question, there are two steps to this uh, answer. So firstly, observation. So when this person uh, nearly exercises, his, ex his body needed more energy. And they have to input the science concept. He breathed faster and deeper to take in more oxygen and remove more carbon dioxide for his muscles to undergo a higher rate of respiration to release more energy. So students are required to have two steps for such explanation questions and they have to memorize the concepts for this topic of respiratory system in order to relate it to different question types. Okay, we have actually prepared a useful concept map for you that summarizes this topic. So if you are interested, download them. Thank you very much. Thank you. To watch more of such videos and information to help your child improve and learn ahead of others in school, visit our website www.agrader.sg, click on this button, fill in your email address and receive all these useful videos straight in your inbox for free. As well as the latest in promotions so that you don't lose out on great deals with A Grader Learning Center.